The James Webb Space Telescope, a revolutionary new telescope, was launched in December 2021. With its advanced technology and capabilities, it will allow us to explore the universe in ways we never thought possible. One of the main goals of the James Webb Space Telescope is to find and examine the exoplanets or planets outside of our solar system. By analyzing the atmospheres of these distant worlds, we may be able to detect the presence of water, oxygen, and other chemicals that are necessary for life as we know it. The James Webb Space Telescope will also be able to study the early universe, giving us a glimpse into the very beginnings of the cosmos. It will be able to observe some of the first galaxies that formed after the Big Bang, helping us to understand how these galaxies evolved and how they contribute to the universe we see today. Let's take a look at recently published high-quality images taken by the James Webb Space Telescope. One of the most iconic images taken is of the Eagle Nebula, a region of active star formation located about 6,500 light-years away from Earth. The Eagle Nebula is home to the famous Pillars of Creation, towering columns of gas and dust that are being sculpted by the powerful radiation of nearby newborn stars. With the James Webb Space Telescope, we are able to get a closer look at these pillars and the processes that are shaping them, giving us a deeper understanding of how stars and planets form in the universe. The high resolution and sensitivity of the telescope allows us to see details in the Eagle Nebula that were never before possible. Another stunning object that the James Webb Space Telescope is the Carina Nebula, a massive cloud of gas and dust located about 7,500 light years away from Earth. The Carina Nebula is home to some of the most massive and luminous stars in the galaxy, and it's a hotbed of star formation activity. The high resolution and sensitivity of the telescope allows us to see details in the Carina Nebula that were never before possible, giving us a better understanding of how these massive stars form and evolve. The Cartwheel Galaxy, a beautiful and unusual galaxy located about 500 million light years away from Earth. It is a lenticular galaxy, meaning it has a disk-like shape with a central bulge, similar to a spiral galaxy. What makes it so unique is the presence of a ring-like structure surrounding its central region. This ring is thought to have formed after the Cartwheel Galaxy collided with a smaller galaxy, causing a shockwave that rippled through the galaxy and triggered the formation of new stars. The Southern Ring Nebula, also known as NGC 3132, is a planetary nebula located about 2,000 light years away from Earth. It is a particularly interesting object because it has a bright central star surrounded by two rings of gas that are tilted at different angles. The high resolution and sensitivity of the James Webb Space Telescope allows us to see details in the Southern Ring Nebula that were never before possible. James Webb not only studies the far reaches of the universe, but also objects within our own solar system. In this image, we can see Neptune, the eighth planet from the Sun, with its rings. The small white dots around Neptune are its moons, and the pointed star above it is Triton, its largest satellite. The spikes seen in the picture are due to the construction of James Webb's mirror system. L1527 is a dark cloud located about 450 light-years away from Earth. Within L1527 is a protostar, a young star that is still in the process of forming. Protostars are thought to be the precursors to main-sequence stars like the Sun, and they are surrounded by disks of gas and dust that will eventually give rise to planets. WR140 is a Wolf-Rayet star located about 5,000 light-years away from Earth. Wolf-Rayet stars are massive, luminous stars that are in a late stage of their evolution. They are characterized by their strong winds of ionized gas and their high temperatures, which can reach up to 100,000 degrees Celsius. WR140 is particularly interesting because it is surrounded by a dusty, torus-shaped structure that is thought to be the remnants of a red supergent star that WR140 has engulfed. This animation shows how dust is produced when the Wolf-Rayet star and the O-type star orbit each other. The Wolf-Rayet star has stronger stellar winds which blow the material from the O-type star back behind it, creating dust as the mixed stellar material cools. As this happens again and again, the dust will form a pinwheel pattern.
M74, also known as the Phantom Galaxy, is a spiral galaxy located about 32 million light years away from Earth. M74 is a relatively small galaxy, but it is known for its beautiful, symmetrical spiral arms and its rich population of young stars and star-forming regions. With the James Webb Space Telescope, we will be able to study M74 in greater detail, getting a closer look at the processes that are shaping its spiral arms and the young stars and gas clouds within them. The James Webb Space Telescope is a truly groundbreaking achievement, and its discoveries have the potential to change the way we understand the universe. We can't wait to see what it will uncover in the coming years. If you find this video interesting, consider subscribing as we are working on several more that will be published very soon. Your comments are always welcome as your feedback helps us to develop the channel.